Cy Creek looking for its first ever state championship and the perfect ending to a storybook season as the Lady Cougars put their perfect 41-0 record on the line against perennial power Duncanville. Early on, Cy Creek's Krishan Lee drives and drops it off for Taylor Jackson basket and a foul for Jackson for the three-point play the old-fashioned way. Later, Kendall Hunter pulls up behind the arc and splashes home the three-pointer to give Cy Creek a 9-5 lead midway through the first. But Duncanville responds with a big 9-0 run to end the period as Deja Kelly knocks down the jumper and the Pantherettes lead by five after one. In the second, Cy Creek's Morgan Hill battling through an ankle injury grabs the rebound and puts it back for two for the Lady Cougars. Then it's Hunter with a nice crossover dribble to create space and free herself up for the open three-pointer. Cy Creek trails 21-17. But the Pantherettes again end the quarter strong. Kelly goes right down Main Street for the layup, and Duncanville builds a 10-point halftime lead. Cy Creek battles back to start the third. Hunter attacks the hoop, drives down the lane to cap off an 8-2 run to open the half. Lady Cougars back within four. No quit in this, in this group. Um, it was a little bit of a momentum. Uh, we didn't get enough stops that, at that moment um, to kind of, you know, go, get over the hump and, and you know, force it within two or even take a lead. Hunter adds another three-pointer midway through the third. She leads all scores with 24 points on the night. Duncanville again answers the Cy Creek run, though. Kelly pours in a team-high 23 points for the Pantherettes, and Duncanville pulls away. Cy Creek falls in the 6A state title game. 63-47 is the final. Cy Creek finishes the season 41-1, and, and despite the loss, it was still a memorable campaign for the Lady Cougars. That's a lot of a lot of success right there and a lot of tests that UA overcame. And even tonight, you know, even though the scoreboard doesn't show, um, these kids became better people tonight, just having to face some adversity and, and, and battle through that. So it just builds character. And so season's not a loss. A lot was learned and a lot of growth for these kids.